I'm your host, Logan Running Three. You joining me for Platinum Chapter Five? Of Pack your bags. So your plane is taking off to New York City in an hour, and then your life will change for forever. No pressure. Okay, let me triple check here. I have my ID, wallet, phone charger, a new record deal. Okay, Cadence, get it together. Morden, Cadence. A fancy running into you here. And Fiona, are we on the same flight to JFK? You could say that. You gather your luggage and follow Fiona past the gates out onto the tarmac. Oh my god! Avery waves to you from the top of the steps of her private jet. Yeah, totally normal. Ready to sail the skies. Um, wow, yes, but don't I have to go through security first? It's just my plane and all, so if you really want Hank to do a double check, I can't oblige. If you're rich enough to fly private, the rules don't apply to you. I mean, that doesn't really seem fair. Write to your member of Congress, you're coming or not. Okay, okay, you don't have to convince me. Climb aboard Avery's lavish jet. Before you know it, the plane is soaring past New York City skyline. Breath catches in your throat as you take a look. It's in a book. Reading Rainbow! We touch down at JFK, a valet attendant talks you carry on into the trunk of a limousine. And you're off, zooming through the city. You press your face against the windows, trying to take it all in. So, Cadence, is New York everything you dreamed it would be? Everything and more. All the neon lights, the skyscrapers. Take your phone off the airplane mode and receive. Cadence, what is up? How are you liking Gotham? The Big Apple. The city is so nice, they named it twice. I'm so happy you're here. We need to hang out ASAP. On the double. Stat. Text me back. Start to type out a reply when you hear Hank's voice. It's not the occupants of this limousine, but I'd like to know that we're coming up on the... The one. The only. Times Square? Oh my god. I'll open the moon roof. Go on. Take it all in. Last panel slides back, and you stand up, gazing at the brilliant lights and the crowds from all around the world. I've never been that fascinated with Times Square. I don't know why. You should wave this horse, belt out a song, ask Avery to stand with me. Your wish is my command. Isn't this special? All the lights, the Broadway marquees. Is that Avery Wilshire? Oh my god, yes! I think that's Kane Dorian too! From one in a million! They're BFFs! Oh my god, Avery, Avery, we love you! And that's my cue to return to my seat. How come? Because tonight is all about you. Alright, back in the car. Next stop, Kane's new apartment. Hold on, my new what? Hank drives you into the heart of the Upper East Side. He pulls over to the curb next to Central Park and the Met. The label will put you up here while you record your album. Ellis Knight specifically picked it out for you. He wanted you to have a label's nicest apartment. Wow, my own place? That's so generous. It works out for everyone. The label expects you to have a hit album soon, which I know you will. Gaines, just remind, just to remind you, you've got your first recording session at Overnight Records in Greenwich Village tomorrow morning. Seven sharp, don't be late. Ellis tells me he lined up the ozone to lay the tracks for your record, so... Wait, ozone? The ozone? The producer who's ruled the Billboard charts for the last year? The guy who made number one hits for Beyonce, Lady Gaga, Taylor Swift, Ariana. The very same. Rest up, Cadence. You're going to need all your energy tomorrow. Who's Ozone? I'm serious, who's Ozone? 
The next morning as the sun rises over New York City. Beep, beep. You fumble for your phone on the nightstand, desperately aiming for the off button. Oh, I feel like I barely slept. I'm so full of adrenaline. Soon you're outside, letting a nice breeze blow over you down the city street. Haynes, you are a long way from home. I wish I could just explore, but I've got to get to the studio. Arrive at the studio with just minutes till 7 a.m. Oh shoot, that commute took way longer than I thought it would. I better hurry inside before... Hey, are you Caden Storian? Uh, yes I am. It's, uh... Not a great time. I'm really running late. Don't have time to chat with fans, sorry. Oh, uh, Bye now. As you step past the kid and in the studio, you let out a frustrated little sigh. Fans invading your privacy already! You're in the lobby, keeping your eyes peeled for... There she is, King Dorian. What a pleasure it is to see you again. Alice, your studio is amazing. This is a dream come true. You will bring your best to every session, and overnight we'll do everything in our power to make your debut album a hit. You may also see Avery ducking in and out. She's been hard at work on our sophomore album, as I'm sure you know. Now, I've brought in a superstar of freelance producer, um, who I'm certain you will lighten the load for you. Cadence, I'd like you to meet the supremely talented Mika Oke, aka Ozone. You look up towards the door and... Actually, we've already met. Oh, crap. This isn't awkward. This isn't awkward at all. Hold on, you... You're Ozone? I am so sorry. <laughs> Don't worry about it. You're not the first person to mistake me for some kid, and you won't be the last. I could have just mistake you for a fan, but... Maybe 16, but I got thick skin about it. Mainly because, to me, y'all are geezers. But I'm 23. Exactly! So, what do you say we get into the booth to see how we work? You old folk don't have much time left, you know? I'm told you already have quite a catalogue of originals. Sounds like we're able to schedule a summer release date for your album. Actually, I was hoping to write mostly new ones. I've grown a, a lot as a songwriter lately, and I only have a few old songs I'm proud of. Besides, I really want to... Mm, create the best possible product for my listeners, enjoy the creative process, and improve as an artist. Eh, create the best possible product. Right, oh yeah, I love working with writers and getting new ideas flowing. I can't wait to see what you're capable of when you have the resources of overnight records at your disposal. But, uh, well, I'll let you both get started. You're having a moment now, Cadence. Let's capture that lightning in the bottle and create some music. Definitely. Reminds me of a Vasquez, but younger and more attractive. Just an Avery enters and lights up when she sees you. Cadence, is Ellis giving you the grand tour? I was just about to leave her in Mika's capable hands. Avery, let's chat. I have some ideas about the next focus group for your follow-up album. Follow me, Keynes. I'll give you the rest of the tour. This is the live room. This is where the magic happens. It's beautiful. Run and two people rolling large, heavy speakers towards another room. Oh, hello. Who's this here? This is Cadence, winner of the record deal. Cadence meet Wade and Luna, equipment managers, road crew, and all around godsends. Wade nods at you, hands in his pocket. Welcome to the rodeo. It's not a rodeo. It's a cold, cruel cycle of relevance and obsolence until you inevitably fade from the public's consciousness and into the anemone and darkness from where we all come. I am Luna. Hey, you two new faces. Oh, hi. Well, we better get started. Later, guys. Yep, 
as uh, Paul Lennar used to tell me, music is what happens when you listen. They drift away. I like Wade. Paul and Art? As in Simon and Garfunkel in the 70s? How? Mika shrugs. What do you mean? What do you mean, how? I mean, the dude's like maybe 60 years old? Maybe 70? Wade's been working at the studio before it even came into Overnight's management. No one knows how long he's been here. On the planet, even. Mika sits down at the grand piano and you get behind the mic. Alright, when I'm working with someone new, I like to just jam and get a feel for each other. Do me a favor and uh, pick a card that uh, from the pile on the stand. Oh, the oblique strategies. The, I know all these. We'll pick one, riff on the concept. Get the brainstorming going, you know? Okay, this card says... Abandoned desire. Once the search has begun, something will be found. Listen to the quiet voice. Once the search has begun. And what does that mean to you? Well, I don't really know how this will end up. If I'll be famous, or if I'll be a one-hit wonder, or a zero-hit wonder. And maybe it would help to focus on the search itself, instead of worrying about what I'll find. Right on! Let's just spend the day exploring, yeah? Who knows what we'll find? Slowly you and Mika begin to play. Listen to the melody. Okay. Soon you're bobbing your head up and down and tapping your foot. Play chords for a while until you find your rhythm together. Alright, now sing something, Keaton! But sing what? Whatever comes to mind! Okay. I like this tune. Hold on. You'll never keep me down. It's time to take a stand. Um. <laughs> and I lost the beat. Cut to. Stand up hand in hand. My freedom I demand. I'll sing across the land. Okay. We'll stand up hand in hand. Alright, not bad. Keep coming. Spent hours singing and workshopping ideas with Mika. And the time flies by. Okay, I'm kind, of, I'm kind of getting used to this, so I kind of wanted to sing a little more. But anyway, later you wrap up in the control room and Avery joins you and Mika. Wow, we've been here for 12 hours? How did that happen? How was your first day? Well, a step in the right direction. How about you? Oh, you know, it's a process. The whole whole sophomore album, but I'm meeting with some very exciting songwriters this week, so that'll kick off soon. She reminds me of Taylor Swift. Speaking of songwriters, Cadence, uh, you've got a fire voice, and I'm gonna have a blast playing with it with uh, Ableton. But when it comes to songwriting, you seem a little, uh, a little what? A little bad? A little nervous, like the inspiration's not really flowing. Oh, no. I I'm not doing it on purpose. Maybe it's because... I'm not used to the pace. Everything's so new and moving so fast. Perhaps we can use that to our advantage. Use that whirlwind of change and, well, turn it into something creative. Right. Live your life to the fullest. Meet new people, see new places, move your body around. I think I know where this is going. Time to hit the club! Um, are you, uh, old enough to get in? Nope! Haven't stopped me yet! Propaganda is, abs is absolutely the hottest place right now. Celebs go there all the time. I am absolutely dying to cut loose after the day of focus grouping I've had. I mean, sure, but I have no idea what to wear in, in an exclusive nightclub. Ahem. What? Who are you? Are you the fashion designer? I don't even know who this woman is. <laughs> I'm sorry, she just did not leave an impression with my ass. Um... I mean, 
You look so good, question mark? Yes, I know. Zadie, I've been following you on Pictogram. Your designs are dope. I'm stoked you'll be working with Overnight. I guess you're useful for something after all, Cadence. Thanks. The point being that I might have a solution to your problem. Oh, that's okay. She leads you all down the hallway to a fully furnished fashion design studio. Wow. Welcome to my domain. If you touch the textiles or my new ringer 77362A sewing machine, I'll only dress you in a rayon. What, what's rayon? Mika, I have something for you too. If the crowd, if the crowds want you to do with the DJ cameo, you'll have to be ready. Ah, huh, looks kind of cool. Dang, Zaddy, this looks fire. Now your turn, Cadence. Before long, Zadie's holding up a shimmering bodycon dress. Not these lyrics, I think he's, I don't I know, understand. I can't lie, you'd look stunning in that. Dress to the nines on your first night out in New York to impress the paparazzi and gain fans. This is the fashion now. <clears throat> Looks like I got mauled by a bear. Or a man in the backseat of a sedan. Light up the night with Times Square. No, thank you. I mean, if you say so, but don't blame us if we get photographed and wind up on the wrong end of who wore it better. Sadie, honestly, don't scare the poor thing. You look great, love. Let's hit it. Glamour pulls up on the curb of propaganda. You can hear the bass thumping inside. Wow, the line again is halfway down the block. How long do you think we'll have to wait? Your celebs and money is power. You're still not quite used to this, are you? Huh, what do you... Except the limo and immediately the whole line starts screaming your names! You see cell phones going up and hear people snapping photos. Oh, <laughs> hi guy from Most Wanted. Avery Wilshire! When well, can we expect a debut of your second album? How soon? Is Caden Story and a difficult artist to work with? Caden Story, any button romances you want to share with us? All right, everybody, hands to yourselves. Don't step past the velvet robe. Yes, you with the man bun, I'm talking to you. Reach the door with Avery, Mika, and Zadie. And the bouncer waves you all in, ahead of the hundreds of people on the line. Whoa, that was fast, and wait, is that DJ Kira Kath? She's here, just casually? Oh, God. Come along, all of you. Let's go to the table. We've got a bottle service waiting for us. Along the way, you reach for your phone to text Shane. Shane, guess where I am? I'm at the propaganda with Avery Wilshire and Ozone. Whoa, look at you. One day in Manhattan, an already celebrity. Go have fun. Tear up the propaganda dance floor. I will, I will, but I miss you. I miss you too. Let's get inspired. Luke's and ah, oh, we have the whole night. Games. What do you uh, always want to do? I've always wanted to hang out in the DJ booth. Okay. DJ Karakat is a friend of mine. You both go on. Zadie and I will hold down the fort here. Wait, Zadie's with us? I didn't even realize. You barely step away when fans swoop in on Avery. Oh, this is where you ended up. Avery, I haven't run into you since we were here in London last summer. Long time no see. Hera Cat, what's up, girl? I care. Ozone, why didn't you tell me you were in town? Get up here. Cat, this is Cadence. Oh, yeah. I've won in a mill fame. You crushed that finale. Thanks, it's so nice to meet you. I'm such a big fan. Oh, yeah, then you'll know how to bounce to this. You hear the first bars of Kira Cat's iconic mashup of Kanye West and David Bowie. Again, I don't know who these people are. Yes, I forgot how much I love this track. Oh, Zone, you mind taking over the booth for a sec? I want to take a quick break. No problem, I got you. What up, everyone? It's Ozone taking over for a few tracks. 
What? Ozone is here? With me, I have a very special guest. You might know her from a recent one in a million victory, and she's not one to be missed. Cadence Dorian! Oh my god, I saw her episode. She was so good. Cadence, pick up some tracks and mash them up. I'll mix them. Okay, let's mash up Seven Rings and Ring of Fire. Dog Days Are Over and Hound Dog. Party in the USA, Born in the USA. Uh, I'm gonna go with Ring of Fire. Ariana Grande goes Johnny Cash, I dig it. Yeah, I didn't, I know, listen to Ariana Grande. Johnny, De or, uh, Johnny Cash, yeah. Mika spins up the turntables and leans in the mic. This one's coming to you hot straight from the mind of Kids Dorian. He drops the beat, sinking the tempos and blending the songs in a elastic mix. The clubbers below start dancing to the music. Ozone and Caden Dorian in one night with a power duo. Could I get a pictogram story in me dancing? I'm loving it. Amazing. I'm loving it too. Start heading back to your table when you see your rally at another table surrounded by gorgeous people vying for attention. <sighs> Another one from AME. So, Riley, how many tattoos do you have? I'll never tell. Riley, I got us another bottle. My friend here is a promoter, so... Riley catches your eye and shrugs them off. Sorry, guys, party's over. My friend's here. They scatter, disappointed. I see you're holding court. Kane's Dorian, all the way in the big city. How'd your first day in the studio shake out? Sorry, what? The music's super loud. You scoot closer to her in the booth until you're practically talking in each other's ears. I said, first day's done. How are you feeling? Like, uh... A small fish in a big sea? I thought the phrase was big fish, a small pond. Not in this case. I feel you. I moved here after I got discovered at 15. And don't worry, you'll get the hang of it. I guess the main thing is having enough inspiration to create a whole album. A word of advice, don't worry about it too much. But there's so much on the line. And there always will be. Now you'll be playing to a larger audience, but you can't get too stuck in the pressure of what people expect from you. Be yourself. Be Cadence. Do whatever you want. That's how the magic happens, right? I don't know that I have the luxury of telling the whole world to screw itself, unlike some people. Maybe not 24-7, but sure feels good, doesn't it? Laugh and lean in to reply. It has its moments, sure. Just a sudden flash, but shrug it off as part of the bright strobe lights. Nope, it's probably paparazzi taking a picture of the both of them. Mika comes by, having finished his turn at the booth. Rally, so good to see you. I'm glad you came out tonight. Of course, didn't want to miss out on the action. Avery and Zadie merge. Sorry, everyone, I, I couldn't get away for a while. I thought the actress and her entourage were going to spoon on the spot. Swoon, swoon, not spoon, but we'll do that too. Anyway, no more sitting. Let's hit the dance floor. You and your friends explore a different room in the club. The DJ drops an R&B song that's pure sex. You recognize the voice. Hold on, this is... This is your song, Rally. Famous is playing. The guilty as charged. Yeah, but I produced it. She doesn't get all the credit. You notice everyone on the dance floor is doing this sexy grinding dance. They look beautiful, confident, you Wish you were brave enough to join them. Man, I wish I could dance like that. You definitely could, and you should probably learn. They come in handy for future performances. I could teach you. Not if I teach her first. Oh. Hmm. What? Shut up. I have a thing. Hmm. I like the song. It's not bad. 
Ants was Zadie and Mika. I'm not sure I feel like doing that kind of dance right now. Yes, probably not to grind like beasts in heat. <clears throat> Zadie, Mika, let's hit the floor. I didn't say that I was a good alternative. Still, she joins you and Mika. Mika moves easily to the rhythm, and even Zadie gets into it once a beat drops. Wow, Zadie, you're graceful. Killing it, Zadie. Chewy! Please stop saying words. I don't come to the dance floor to talk. Three of you dance away, not caring who sees. In the on the way home, your friends lie around bleary eyed, but you're busy scrolling lyric ideas in your notebook at light speed. All this time, I've been so naive. Up the page, determined to continue writing, drawing inspiration from your adrenaline filled night. I've been so deceived. And I'm trying to believe. Maybe I'm onto something. Luma comes to a stop outside your new apartment. Alright, kids, you take care now. Get eight hours of sleep, dissolve some electrolyte tablets in your water. Will do, Hank. And never stop being overproductive. <laughs> I am the perfect amount of productive. Thank you. Say goodbye, dear friends. And flop onto your couch, ready to write some more. You feel your phone buzz in your pocket and pull it out. Huh, emails from Ellis. Uh, hi, Caden. Re, our discussion today, I'd like to drum up some publicity for you while you're working on the new record. I booked a music video shoot for your new song going into production later this week. Details TBD will keep you posted. Best Ellis Knight. Whoa, a real music video? This is big, this is huge, this is. The phone buzzes again, and it's a text from Shane. Looks like tonight was fun. Chain sent you a link. It opens up Day a Magazine, the website of the tabloid. Inside the article is a high-resolution photo of you with the propaganda, sitting very closely to Rally. What the? Suddenly remember the white flash you saw in the club. Uh-oh. Hey, congrats, you just broke the 1,000 fans. A new heart to break. Valley Carrera spotted getting close to a young starlet. No one can break my heart. Because it's already broken in a million pieces and no one's cared to glue it back together. Anyway, with that being said, <laughs> I hope y'all did enjoy the video. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And down in the description below, links to our social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, the whole nine yards, as well as a few links to support me and my content, as well as a link to our Discord. Come hang out with me and many other people. Chat, voice chat, share pictures, music, the whole nine yards, even talk about choices, chapters, and anything you really want to talk about. And without further ado, thanks for tuning in, and I will catch you, star-studded beautiful people, in the next video. Peace out.